So the first part is he just needs to be comfortable with me holding his harness. Okay. This is also good because now a lot of the time when you go to grab the harness, they kind of dance out the way and yeah. they're like, what are you doing? Because yeah. it's just not normal. So this is building up a positive association with that as well. So what I'm going to do first, <laughs> I'm going to hold his harness, the handle on his harness. As I do that, I'm going to reward him. So this is good as well for like the vets because they are going to lean over yeah. and grab him in ways that he's a bit like, whoa, yeah. why are you doing that? So now that he's comfortable with the harness being touched, coming in to have it held. And I'm literally just, the second it hits the floor, I let go. So he's just feeling that tension for half a second before I then go, okay, get it. But I'm getting him quite excited to chase this ball, but he's gonna wait just half a second. Good boy. So I'm literally just getting him used to this feeling of frustration. Yeah. Yeah. as being something that he doesn't have to fight and get annoyed by. It's actually quite fun. So it's, I'm literally just making it like millisecond by millisecond longer that I'm holding him before he gets to go get that. And this, eventually you're gonna start to take the pressure off the hand. So he just sits here whilst you throw it and then you use your cue to go second round to it, okay? Good boy, where's your ball? Nice!